Hey, how's it going, everybody? I'm the DigiNerdster, and today we're gonna be continuing Metal Gear Solid 2. Uh, Sons of Liberty? Or. Oh, wait, there's a bad guy across the hall. Um, body armor? Uh, what can I use? Okay. I don't... Who am I supposed to be looking out for? Okay. Where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. Do I press this? No. DG camera? Okay. Where am I going? I need to get to the computer room, but I don't know where it is. Is it this way? EF connecting bridge? Is it this way? Hello? Anyone gonna tell me where I need to go? Colonel, I've reached shell one. Yay. Good. I see you managed to make it across the oil fence. Did Can't we? Hurry. Emma should already have reached the computer room. Fine, the computer the room. To stop Arsenal Gear is to have Emma introduce the virus you're carrying into the system. Yeah, I know that. Not a second to lose. Get yourself to the computer room on the B2 level of Shell 1's core. Okay. Emma is not doing very well. Jack, hurry. Okay. Where are we? We're here. Okay, if we go back through here, where are we? Strut E parcel room? Okay, so we are going the right way. That's good. Hello? Ah, okay. Uh, let's equip the uh, PSG. Where is it? Why doesn't that kill it automatically? Fudge. Fudge. Come on. What? It says it's right here. What? Where is it? Oh, there you are. Alright, let's go. Think I go this way? Oh. Let's run across. That was stupid. Okay, uh... Okay. Are we there yet? We're on the shell core. How do we get into the basement? What is... Okay! Um, do we have rations? Huh, not a lot. Uh, what was the other thing? Thermal? Well, shit. Okay. Do I need to shoot that? No. Okay. Let's switch back to the body armor. Is this where I need to go? Oh. How do I get that? Come on. There we go. Shaft grenade. Okay, I already got that because I can see everything. Okay, now I don't trust hallways. Okay. How do I get to the computer room? I don't understand. Duh. That's what I needed to do. I'm an idiot. <laughs> get to the basement. How do I get to the basement? <laughs> so here comes the longest cinema of this game, I think. 
At least she's bandaged. Does she really need that many bandages for one stab wound? So you just. <laughs> I think he got some internal organs. We can't stop. Oh no. You mean like her intestines? Wait, what's she doing? I'm here. Okay. Yeah, of course. I've just been blown up a few times. Emma set everything up. Uh, apparently, all you have to do is pop in the disc. Nice. Let's do that. I hope. Certainly, this won't be a trap. Should insert the virus into the AI. Is it working? Looks Can like it it's Emma? loading or something. What the? It's a blue screen of death. An antibody agent. Oh. The connection's been cut. How how do we uncut it? I don't think so. The count stopped at 90%. Great. I don't think Emma's made any mistakes, but they must have caught on. The cluster might have been altered after the disc left Emma's hands. Great. Will the virus still work? I have no idea. Well, that's just prime. How is is what? Tell me. Is everything all right? Nah. But you can't just say that. It's all right. Yeah. Everything's all right. Sure it is. Good. At least I. What? I won't be adding another page to our family's dark history. Oh no. Yeah, that's right. But she's not related to him by blood, right? So. What if the virus doesn't work? Either destroy that thing, or take out Solidus and his men. How do we get on board? Huh. I don't think we can. Unless somebody inside gives us a hand. Like who? How? Like the Russian? I... I always... What is it? Don't say what is it, just let her speak. What? You're a brocon? Wanted to see you again. Okay. You don't hate me. Oh. These characters that I just got introduced to, I care so much about them. I never wanted to hurt you. I mean, I guess that's why we had a whole bunch of cutscenes with her. Okay. Just so just like Meryl with her father. Except with a woman. What? I could never do that. Don't be so honest. It hurts. Sorry. So she wanted she, she really is a brocon then. Is did I did, did I did I just read that right? Okay, well, it's only pseudo-incest. Uh, what's that? You, you want a kiss or something? You're gonna take off the glasses? What? There we go. What's wrong with E.E.? Aw, he's crying. And she dead. Emma? Or in, she's gone into shock. Emma? Emma? Emma! <laughs> Answer me! Well, she dead. Oh no. I'm sorry, I just met her, and I don't really care that much. I get it, it's supposed to be set for Otacon, but this is the first game he's mentioned her. I didn't... Well, the sunset. 
because of the accident I had what I had a relationship with your mother oh damn she me. and it went on Jeez, Otacon, you don't have to make all your weeaboo fantasies come to life. My father's death was no accident. <laughs> oh, shit. Took his own life. Oh, okay, good. I thought you killed him. It was my fault. All my fault. Forgive me, Emma. I guess his stepmother wanted some of that nerd dick. <laughs> that never happens in real life. <laughs> Which is why I affect the hentai. <laughs> The bird? What's, what's with the bird? Does he have like a secret password that'll make everything work? Or what? Why? The bird's gonna die out in the open sea. Don't let it fly away. And birds don't trust people. Like, you have to earn their trust over time. How does... The bird's probably going to be very stressed out if you just start crying like that with it's on, on your arm, if it doesn't know you. Attention. Arsenal gear is ready for launch. Evacuate the upper levels immediately. Oh, no. Sounds like they're cutting this area loose. What do you mean? It means we're going to sink. We have to get the hostages out. What about the camera repairs? Done. We won't be able to get everybody aboard. We'll just have to take as many as we can. My okay. Sister... What? Won't be able to come with us. Oh. We will be commencing the countdown shortly. Personnel in the upper level. Because she, she's dead anyway, and we need to put lives above. You don't need a body to bury. Just, just a memory. But damn, Otacon got some of that milk pussy. <laughs> Why, Wolf? All right, he had a crush on Sniper Wolf, and she was nice to him. Probably only because he wasn't a soldier, and he was a nerd. Otacon, take care of the hostages. Or he wasn't what about like. You guys? We got other arrangements. Hoot calling her? Is that is that she he wasn't like immediately like yo, I want some of that ass. I should be going or was it that he didn't like underestimate her just because she, she was a woman? I don't know, I forget. You mean I'd only get in your way. Yes! Wrong. Only you can save those hostages. Got it? Okay, if the bird's not I, I mean I could see the bird not being scared of Otacon, maybe because it has like Maybe he has her scent or whatever, but I'm pretty sure the bird would be scared of snake. Eliminate the enemy. That's your only option. Good. Okay, that's that's kind of cool. Shame there's no blanket or something we could put over. I mean, I guess if it's sinking, then it wouldn't matter. But I mean. Okie dokie. E -E? Damn. What? Try to get as many hostages out as you can. It's a short flight to the shore, so don't worry about overloading the cam off. Okay. If you say so, I think it'd be pretty bad if it sank. <laughs> or if it, like, went down because it was overweight. Leave it to me. Then again, how overweight would it have to be if it if it could get off? Then I, I'm sure that like if it could take off, then it wouldn't. I don't know what I'm. Trying. They just did a super cool bro thing, and I just talked over it like an idiot. Well, what's new with DG? I wish I had a boyfriend. <laughs> Is that what you're thinking, Ren? And I'm only joking, of course. Aww. Why is it repeating that? It doesn't even sound like a parrot. It'd be more... pitchy. Oh, okay. 
Well, maybe if you didn't sleep with her mother, you could have slept with her. <laughs> you and me, we're the same. Who? Yeah. Talking to her or? Both you and I. Okay. We were always alone. Always. It's always weird when the, we when something tries to we were always like explain a side character or whatever something. when they have barely like Somebody participated or us, but we were wrong. they've barely been a part of the main we plot. Wait to be loved. I mean, I he's you a key like find it. character behind the scenes, but I mean, he's. Then you shouldn't have screwed your stepmother. I learned that I could love. As you probably did. Emma. Huh. You think he's gonna be okay? It's like the opposite with Jojo though. It's like especially this season, it's like everyone has more character than Jerono. <laughs> you can come out now. Eh? A ninja? What the? Yeah, it's the ninja we've been. Arsenal's going to take off. We still need you to take care of a few things. Okay. This time, I'll fail us. Snake, what's this all about? Well. Bedtime, right? Oh, I'll do that. What? You're changing sides now. Sides. I don't recall saying I was on yours. What? Damn it. Okay. You ready for some shit? <laughs> you. Oh, oh, vibrations. Better put this on my dick. <laughs> I'm joking. I, I, my sense of humor is terrible, I know. Oh, so he got vibro... Electrified? Vibrofied? How does that work? How do you get shocked? I mean, I guess there's an energy current flowing through it and she just... Desynchronized the energy from the molecular what levels of the thingy. Uh, how do they work? Oh. Is it kind of funny that I thought of a Titanic reference and Raiden's name is Jack? Where's Metal Gear Titanic? <laughs> I can barely s Okay, that's better. But during these night scenes, I can barely see anything on my TV screen. Okay. Hello? Jack, are you reading me? Do you want to save your mission data up to this point? Yes. Why wouldn't I? We got some... We got some heavy story shit happening. I'm, like, at the last level, I think. After these... Cutscenes. Your mission data's been saved. Yay! Hello? Is he, still, Is he alive? still alive? Yeah? He was he when Olga brought him in. Okay, thanks. I've checked everything, including the genome data, but there's nothing on this guy. Why? NSA, CIA, FBI. He doesn't exist in any database. He's a non existent operative from a non existent organization. What? I suspected as much. However, I know this man. Hmm? Wake him up. Yeah, Solidus, your daddy. <laughs> I mean, are we gonna get Raiden's backstory now? Hello? Doc Ock? <laughs> it's been a while, hasn't it? Yeah. Jack the Ripper. What? Why is it so shaky? God damn. Because we're drugged? You remember me, don't you? 
You've grown. Oh, oh, okay, Daddy, no. High concentration of cerebral implants. Okay. Have they altered your memory too. What? A hitting triangle. Yeah. Nice suit. Okay. My son. I taught him everything. No, you didn't. Didn't you send him off to whatever and then like have them do terrible things as a death squad Jack, and that's where you learned everything? I never thought I'd see you again. You know me? Yes. Yes, you he don't does. Remember. No. Your name, your skills, everything you know, you learn from me. What? Well, the eighties, <laughs> a civil war. You were one of the best among the child soldiers that fought. Oh, in the good, child soldiers! Yay! When you were barely ten years old, you became the platoon leader of the small boy unit. At the time, uh -huh. your outstanding kill record earned you several nicknames, including White Devil and Jack. It's the same. It's a shame such a pretty boy had to go through so much. My, he is adorable. When the war ended, you disappeared from the relief center. I wondered what happened. Why'd you have to turn such an adorable person into a killer? Recruit you. Who recruited me? Oh, the Patriots. Is that who we've been working for? It's an interesting coincidence. If he's a lackey for the Patriots, I doubt he knows anything of interest. <laughs> True. What should we do with him? We'll use him like you suggested. Uh, no tentacle or stuff, please. Cell. Ignore them. <laughs> oh, there is liquid. Did you forget about me? Happening again? Yeah, your Could brother keeps. He's here too. Snake? I mean, the other snake. In another hour, we demonstrate the power of Arsenal gear. Okay. Jack with standard weapons, of course. Yes, proceed as planned. At last report, all is well with GW. Okay. Hmm. How about the troops? The men are being refitted with Arsenal gear. Oh, <laughs> sorry about that snort. <laughs> but if he's another clone of Big you Boss, shouldn't he be voiced by David or sound more like him? <laughs> I'm going to use my lips when I laugh. So? Perhaps I should be grateful to this kid for that. What? I read Big Boss. Sorry, I talk too much. This situation, I find it very nostalgic. Oh, because a oh, Solid I? Snake. Why inside Arsenal gear, of course. Except Solid Snake wasn't naked. Actually. We're also inside the memory of Shadow Moses. What? I'll take this back. You don't need this anymore, do you? I might. Didn't... The foul wind is blowing. Okay. We shall speak again. I'm guessing this is all just to get him inside, right? And that she and Snake have been working together because she's been helping Stay us. You are. We're being monitored by a camera. Then you shouldn't you be to? talking through your codec instead of I'm using your lips? There we go. Why didn't you start like that? Mr. X? Ninja? Yep. Correct. It's me. I thought you were the leader of the Russian troops. <laughs> no, that was just a smokescreen. Smokescreen? Smoke Where? I was sent to provide you support. Support? Who sent you? The Colonel? Snake. No. The Patriots. Oh. What? I... I deceived my troops. Betrayed them. But why? My child is being held hostage by the Patriots. Oh, okay. Two years ago and Snake agreed to help you, right? During the tanker incident, my men and I had nowhere to go. So we joined forces with an illegal Russian organization. Because that would go well. Something like that, actually. I learned much later that it was a subordinate organization of the Patriots. You'd think I most military corporation or groups would be. My child, 
It turned out I was... Oh, right, she was pregnant during that mission, wasn't she? In the morning, my child was gone. My baby is being kept somewhere in this country. In America? Have you ever met your child? No. Once a month, they send me a photo of my child via network. I oh, never even great. The child in my own arms. I see. As long as they're keeping Get it healthy. Situation. Nobody can blame you for what you did. That's your opinion. <laughs> what about Snake? I thought you were enemies. He wasn't responsible for my father's death. Good. Actually, we owe him our lives. Nice. Two years ago, they uh -huh. were responsible for getting us out of the sinking tanker alive. Yes. <laughs> so you were partners since the incident? No, I only found out the truth shortly before this. Huh? When I confronted him here. Oh, uh, okay. You fought with Snake? When? <laughs> well, it was around the time you were holding hands with that girl. <laughs> Snake. But... He was he was providing sniper cover. What? How did? How does? I was able to fight her and so you joined okay. hands with him to pay back a debt. No, mutual gain. Mutual gain. My job was to assist you. If Solomon uh -huh. gets away with Arsenal, your mission is a failure. The Patriots would judge that as failure on my part and terminate my child. Terminate. Simply, my child's life depends on your success. So you did it all for your child. But why would the Patriots want to help me? Are they hoping I'll take Solidus out? Probably. No, you're just like me. We're just pawns. Pawns for what purpose? The S3 plan. Eh? Huh? You'll figure it out sooner or later. But I wonder if you'll handle the truth. What do you mean? Listen, we haven't got time for this. Okay. Solidus will commence his attack any minute. He's got to be stopped. No matter the... I keep making that no joke. So far. Slash reference. I think the Patriots have tampered with the program. Will it work? I don't know. Get me out of this thing. Not yet. <laughs> I'll release your restraints after I leave this room. Okay. Where's my gear? Snake's got everything. I couldn't bring it here. And where do I find Snake? <laughs> he should be around here somewhere. It's been half... It is, this has almost been half an hour. To a hangar. He'll be waiting there. I gave him a card key for the hangar. Okay. The snake plans to destroy Arsenal gear? This really is a long ass cutscene. For Snake, it's impossible to completely destroy this thing. The only option is to stop Solidus and his men. Those are the rays, I guess. Stay concealed. Why are they called rays? They don't even look like stingrays. They look more like I mean, they look like dinosaurs. Olga, you can't keep this up. They're bound to find you. Yeah. Listen, I'll free you in a little while. Okay. Brace yourself. Huh? Okay. Well, fuck you too. Hello. Eh. 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 There. Eh. Did I press something? Hello. I can't see what I'm attached. Hello. Jack, are you all right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Jack, is it true what Solidus said? Yes. It's unbelievable. Yeah. They're drafting small children, sending them to war. It's not allowed under international conventions. Doesn't stop I South Africa. Or was it North Africa? War. Someone told me that I forget where the rebels lie. And children in combat right now. I was just one of them. So you remember? I thought your memory had been manipulated by them. It was, but I have nightmares every day. Pieces of the past I can't put together. Okay. Why didn't you tell me? You couldn't begin to understand. <laughs> you wouldn't know that until you try me. How could you understand what it's like to be a to child hurt. soldier? <sighs> there was never a real reason for me to fight, except that someone put a gun in my hand. Okay, well, I guess I'm putting my controller down. Should have brought some popcorn. Damn. It wasn't your fault. And I hear Metal I Gear 4 is, like, fight, worse. I was praised, fed, and had a bed to sleep in. I, I mean, it has more cutscenes than, like, gameplay. Day, but I'm not even sure or was that. it 8 hours of cutscenes yeah. and 10 hours of gameplay, I forget. I'm not Snake. I never questioned why we fought. There was no purpose, no way out. They give you a gun, you ask how many to kill. If you didn't, okay. you were the one they shot instead. It's okay. 
No one is blaming you. Are you sure about that? I was shown Hollywood action films every day. The kind with macho guys and big guns. Okay. They call it image training. <laughs> they they built us from the ground up into killing machines. But they know those movies are fake, right? Fed once a day, I can still taste the gunpowder. Like none of the violence violence in there is realistic. In the food? The gunpowder had toluene in it, giving it hallucinogenic properties. It kept us. Then why not just give you the toluene? Oh my god. <sighs> See? When the Civil War ended, those of us who survived were taken in by NGOs. NGOs? Gave me a new life in the States. I can't complain. But nothing's changed. The only people who have no problem with my past have secrets and agendas of their own. Okay. Terrible nightmares every night. I can never forget. Yep, I, I get it, Jack. <laughs> I'm afraid of the night. That's why I don't sleep next to you. You should have told me. <laughs> Why, well, you're afraid you're gonna kill her like Wolverine killed his Rose? And always have been? No, no. What I hate more than anything else in the world is my own past. Darkness. Or anyone to know about. No parents. <laughs> now I know why I was chosen for this mission. No one can take him on, take him down, except. Cause standing here. <laughs> this, I knew as soon as I saw Solidus. Jack, I love you the way you are now. You have to believe me. Nah. I didn't know anything about you. I admit that. Where you were born, how you grew up, but I know that now. Uh, I know that he only I told you a bit of it. Can only <laughs> get better, and I'll share in your past if that's the price. It doesn't work that way. No one can share the burden of what I've done. It's not one of those warm and fuzzy things couples share. Okay, but couples don't share just the Jack. good things. <laughs> That's what you do for someone you love. I don't want to share my past with anyone. I just want to forget about it. Jack, I haven't told you, you know, about what I've done. Uh-huh. The last two years with you, it's been more than I've ever hoped for. Jack. Jack. I can't go any farther. I know you want to get married. I. But I can't. I can't risk starting a family. What if she's already There's pregnant? No to erase my childhood. <laughs> it's all right, Jack. Please, don't say any more. <laughs> It's too painful. Oh, there we go. That was like, oh, we naked. Can I touch this? No. Okay. Oh, we can go through there. No, nothing. We can go through here. We can press this. <laughs> Alright, let's get the map data. Exit. Alright. Gen. Hello. Raiden. Do you copy? Yeah. Let's continue your m mission. Oh. I lost all my gear. I need to locate Snake. He was never factored into the simulation. Leave him out of this. I can't do much naked, especially <laughs> in this temperature. That's true. You won't be able to attack or enter the hanging mode either. I think Snake has Why? my gear. Why? Right. Because we can't show Take his penis. Solidus and his men. You must recover Arsenal intact. Intact. Colonel, are you under orders from the Patriots? <laughs> your role. That is mission. I don't think he's the real and disarm the terrorists. My role? Why do you keep saying that? Why not? This is a type of role playing game. The point is that you what? play out your part, and I expect you to turn in a perfect performance. Colonel, I just remembered something. What? What? That I've never met you in person. Not once. 
Complete your mission according to the simulation. Colonel, who are you? No more questions. We have Rosemary. What do oh. you mean by that? Over and out. Bum, bum, bum. Yep, I'm naked. How do I do this? What do I do? Okay. I have nothing. What do I do? Are there any more people I can call? Snake? No response. Uh, Stillman's dead. No response. Okay. I have nothing. What am I supposed to... Can I punch? Okay. I almost made a mistake. What is that? Okay. Is he knocked out for good? Okay. I can't see shit. Can't really do anything. Okay. Away from the get close and oh no. I'm under enemy fire. Secure the perimeter. Understood. All units exercise extreme caution. Well shit. What do I do? Okay, running. Ration. Okay, I have a ration at least. Right. So far, so good. Okay. Running. Hello? You there? Raiden, turn the game console off right now. No. What did you say? The mission is a failure. Cut the power right now. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Don't worry. It's a game. It's a game just like usual. You'll ruin your eyes playing so close to the <laughs> TV. What are you talking about? Raiden, something happened to me last Thursday when I was driving home. Really? A couple of miles to go. I looked up and saw a glowing orange object in the sky to the east. It's it was the sun. Very irregularly. Suddenly, there was intense light all around me. And when I came to, I was home. What do you think happened to me? Huh? Fine. Forget it. Okay. Hmm. Hello? Even my patience has its limits. I just can't leave this thing up to you any longer. What are you talking I'm about? Fighting. You can just go home. Okay. Hmm? Who's there? I'm under attack. Stay alert. Hmm. Really? What am I supposed to do? I can't do shit. Box. Really? Come on. Stop it. Hello? Fortress. 
outer heaven. Oh. Destroy the final weapon. <laughs> Metal Gear. Okay. Ah, jeez. Yeah. Damn it. What am I supposed to do? What do I do? Damn it. Yes. Hello. Hello. Uh huh. No. Damn it! I'm. I'm dead. I'm dead. I have no healings. I have no healing items. I'm just dead. Okay. Made it. Maybe. Yes, I'm dying. Hello. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, supposed to be the credits or what? Hello? Yes. Actually, there is something I have been meaning to tell you, but I just couldn't. And what's that? You should know, though. On Saturday morning last week, I saw a guy leaving Rosemary's room. <laughs> How should I put it? It was like they were intimate. I'm sorry. Yeah, sure. Sorry to bring this up during the mission, but... Oh, a skull. Some sort of android? Well, I got a ration, at least. President Baker should be somewhere to the south of where you blasted through the wall. <laughs> Hurry and save him before the terrorists discover his code. So I'm guessing he's an AI? What is that? What the heck's that? Actually, I'm in really bad shape financially. <laughs> I pay money to my ex-wife as part of our divorce settlement, among other bills. Really? I had no choice but to make you pay for lunch the other day. I'm really sorry. We never met in person. Do I go the other way? Yes. Variety level 13. Uh-huh. Rescue Melody. The return of Genola. <laughs> what? Right, what are they doing? I'm just, I'm, I'm just going. Okay. Hello. Jack, it's me. Hi. Rose. Jack, I owe you an apology. For it was what? About that conversation just now. I'm the one who's sorry. No, it's something else. Like what? What is it? That day at Federal Hall two years ago, it wasn't a coincidence. What? I was ordered to keep an eye on you. Keep what? An eye on me. Yes, by the Patriots. Here we go. You're a spy? Yes. I suppose. Yes. It's an ugly word. Not really. Spies are usually like the super sexy, you know. Are you still there? Was sleeping with me a part of the job? Oof. I fell in love with you. How could anyone? I can't excuse what I did. <laughs> I've reported every detail of your personal life to them these two years. What Go. you did, said, Good. everything. Yeah. It must have been fun. But some things I didn't tell anyone. Like? Like what I felt for you. So that's why you were involved in this mission. I should have known. Why else would they throw <laughs> some analyst into the mix at the last minute? I'm sorry. I know what I did was wrong. 
no matter how do you know you're not go, being monitored I used i reinvented myself to suit your tastes oh Hair style clothes the way i moved things i talked about you say you love the color of my hair, my eyes. They're not even real. What? You must have gone over my psych profile with a fine-tooth comb. It was my job. How did they change your eyes to be and hair to be so realistic? I mean, I guess nano machines. What I really wanted was for you to My dog's sitting on a bag because his blanket's being washed. <laughs> he looks so sad. It was worse to lie to myself than to you. The more love you gave me, Aww. the more it hurt. Because I knew the person you loved was just a character. Technically, you're all characters. On my end too. It was just a game, not the real thing. Oh, <laughs> Jack. I feel better knowing that. What? I was in love, or thought I was, with someone who didn't exist. I was trying to be someone I wasn't by loving what wasn't real. I don't know who you really are. The person I knew uh -huh. isn't real. She's not the woman I'm talking to right now. In a sense, the deception was my own, not theirs. Jack, I thought I was acting because that was my job. But I did fall in love with you. That wasn't an act. You expect me to believe that? Uh -huh. It's okay. You had your reasons, right? Hey, I understand. But I have nothing left to... Jack! Yes? What? I'm... I'm carrying... Oh. Rose! What's going on? The communication was cut. Hello? <laughs> Amazing how you walk around like that. What? Snake! Been waiting long? Yeah. He's got the classic outfit on. Look at the mask. <laughs> Where's my gear? Right over there. Oh. Nice. Why is the floor like that? It makes no practical sense. That's more like it. Everything you had when you were captured is still there. Nice. Okay. Godek? Why were you ignoring my call, Snake? Sorry about earlier. I had to use you as bait to gain access to Arsenal. It worked. Yay! Why didn't you tell <laughs> me about Olga? You never asked. <laughs> Not happy about that? Get over it. Any effects of the virus yet? Still waiting on that. Great. So it was rigged by the Patriots? Looks like it. Mm -hmm. From what I can tell, Arsenal is headed for Manhattan. I don't Yay, know it's doomed. Planning, we'll have to deal with it one way or another. When the, the, when did this have been like close to, that? you know, 9/11? 25 according to Olga. 25? Yeah. Can't say I've faced that many metal gears before. 25 rays? No way we can. We can because we have no other choice. How? I've stocked up on stinger missiles. Nice. Oh yeah. Olga left this for you. What is it? Tell me. Oh, we get... Does this turn into an hack and slash? Why? Olga asked me to give it to you. Besides, I'm not a big fan of blades. <laughs> <laughs> huh. Okay. Move the right stick up and down to make a vertical slice, and left and right to slice parallel to the ground. Move the stick in a circle to do a rotating cut. Like that? Push it forward to lunge and strike. This doesn't make any sense. Why? You guard with your blade if you have the L1 button pressed down. You should be able to deflect a bullet or two. Okay. Okay, just use the stick. Okay. Use the stick and L1. There we go. Should should I cut you or We should heal. Okay. Do I need to practice my stuff on you, Snake? What are you thinking? 
You said the... Okay. Can we leave now? Oh, I need to plunge. There we go. Yes. Yes. Well, it's cool. Come on, time to go. It's very different from the rest of the game, the mechanics. But it, it's if not that ammo, difficult. You can have mine. You got enough? Absolutely. <laughs> Infinite ammo. Really? Wait up, snake. What? Yeah. Snake, have you ever enjoyed killing someone? What are you talking about? Probably. I'm not sure. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference between reality and a game. <laughs> Diminished sense of reality, huh? VR training will do that. No, it was field training when I was a kid. I lied, Snake. I have more field experience than I can remember. It's not VR that's doing this to me. Raiden, we don't carry guns to take people down. We're not here to help some politician either. You can say that because you're a legend, a hero. I'm not a hero. Jack the Ripper, a dirty reminder of a terrible mistake. Legends don't mean a whole lot. I was just a name to exploit, just like you. People will remember only the good part, the right <laughs> part of what you did. There's no right part in murder, not ever. And we're not in this to make a name for ourselves. But you're a soldier. And what are you and Otacon fighting for? A future. You can stop being part of a mistake, starting now. What am I? What am I supposed to do? Uh, sword? Find something to believe in, and find it for yourself. Something to, to believe in. Future. Believe in what? That's your problem. <laughs> Come on. Alright. Just us and Snake, and someone's calling us already. Snake, Raiden. Yeah. Oracon, you all right? Yeah. So are all the hostages. Yay! How's everything on your end? All right for now, but there is something. What? The Colonel's last transmission was strange. Yeah. Strange? Almost like he was oh, a machine. Just strange. No idea. Interference? I don't know. Where is <laughs> this Colonel? I don't know. I've never met the man actually. Yeah. I'll dig around. Thanks. I owe you <laughs> one. If there's anything else, call me on the codec. I might be able to help. The frequency is 141.12. I can see that. Okay. Oh, goody. Nani? Oh, uh, body armor, right? How do I aim with this? God damn. Am I hitting anything? Yay. Am I hitting anything? What the Hit his foot. Hurry up. There we go. Okay. Oh. No, oh, no, they have swords. Now uh, let's heal. Yes. Make sure to close on the body armor. I can't see in the dark. I mean, I guess I have, like, night vision, but... Okay. Okay. 
Uh huh. Where? Thank you. I'm trying. It's like headshots don't count or something. Alright, let's see. What's... Uh, let's use the blade here. Hey guys! Alright. Am I doing something? Can't tell. Snake, do you got the guys up there? There we go. Let's heal again. Just to be on the safe side. Hello? Raiden, about this colonel of uh -huh. I found out where he is. Really? Where? Inside Arsenal. What? I've checked out all the possibilities, but I keep coming back to Arsenal. It isn't a relay point. It's the origin of the signal. Hmm. And the encryption protocol it uses is exactly the same as that of Arsenal's AI. Okay. So-called GW. What the hell does this mean? I think it means you've been talking to an AI. Yay. <laughs> That's impossible. The colonel probably isn't GW per se. GW was most likely stimulating cortical activity in the dormant part of your brain through signal manipulation okay. of your own nanomachines. The kernel is, in part, your own creation, cobbled together from expectations and experience. Okay. That's crazy, but it's probably the truth. The virus may be starting to affect GW, which would explain the kernel's behavior. Well, that's good news. Oh, an illusion? Everything I've done so far? Right. Snake, what's happening around here? I don't know. What I do know is that you're standing right here in front of me, not and realizing flesh that you're just like me. <laughs> it's your call. You can drop this if you want. No, I can't do that. Let's go. Okie dokie. Sig mode colon. Hello? Raiden. They've got Rose. What? Rose is being held in the holds. It's a trap. Help! Rose! But you mean Rose has a dick? A grip. But Snake. I'm, I'm kidding. Trap. Since the Colonel doesn't <laughs> exist, there's no way he can take Rose hostage. Yeah, you're right. I am right. Okay. Uh, does Rose exist? <laughs> Don't be weird. She's your. What if I've never really met her? What? If the Colonel is something that I partly dreamt up, then. Everything I remember about her could be... Don't jump to conclusions. <laughs> you and Otacon are the ones that say the Colonel never existed. Raiden, is this what Olga was talking about? What? Oh, cool. Ration. Uh, hello? Oh. Goody, more super soldiers. It's the Foot Clan. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm using the blade. It's cooler. Oh, what? Stupid game. I want to use the blade. Oh, I can deflect bullets. Cool. This is such a weird way to fight, using the stick. I mean, I guess they do something similar with the blade mode in Metal Gear Rising, but it's it's not like this. It's a little more controlly. Yeah, no. I can still do shit. Emit. 
is weird. What the heck? Okay. Okay. Hideo Kojima likes to break the fourth wall sometimes. Oh, sorry. Alright. Nice. Hello? Oh, it's you! Railgun lady. What are you doing here? It's been a long wait, Solid Snake. The root of all my sorrows. Really? Two years ago, you killed my father. That was the beginning of hell for us. Everyone okay. Everyone I love has been taken from me one by one. And no matter how hard I try, I can't follow them. Okay. Nightmare. The only thing Maybe you should stop holding that magnetic gun. Our wait is almost over. You can't be serious about firing the nuke. Since no one can kill me, I may as well kill everyone I can. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Damn. Looks like I'm today's pick. You go on ahead. Okay, dokie. You enjoy your confrontation. You want eternal rest? I've got it right here. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Bullets can't get near her. I'll think of something. <laughs> There's no such thing as a witch. You think you can kill me? I mean, he just has to get close. Group's been through, but let's get one thing clear. I didn't kill your father. Do you think anyone believes your lies? Right. Get out of here. I mean, he's kind of the only one who's been telling the truth. <laughs> Okay. I guess we'll miss the cool fight. Hell, uh, okay. What the heck is this? Rectum? Is that what it says? Jack, I've been watching how you fight. Really? It looks like you've remembered the way you used to kill in the old days. Really? Because I suck at this game. One of the S3 plan's proud achievements. What are you talking about? <laughs> it came as a complete surprise oh. when Ocelot discovered the S3 data from GW. Not a bad idea, though. Using fire to fight fire, creating the perfect assassin to retire Solid Snake's brother. Uh huh. S3 stands for Solid Snake Simulation. Oh. It's a development program to artificially reproduce Solid Snake, the perfect warrior. I see. The result is a Foxhound Commando. When Foxhound no longer exists, a simulated Solid uh -huh. Snake shaped by VR regimen. Sound like someone you know, Jack. Okay. I'm sorry to see you reduced to one of the Patriots' puppets. But I've made use of you. And really? I plan to. Solid Snake's sudden appearance, your arrival. It was obvious the Patriots were among my ranks. I had to yeah, we can still flip. Agent before the mission entered the final phase. You came in handy as bait. Great, I'm gonna heal. Jack, those days during the Civil War were as real as they come. Every day was absolute. Split between life and death. Uh-huh. You ran from it. And now you've been led back to war by something less than real. I mean, everything that's real is just in your brain. That's cool. No more games, Jack. At least you know. There's no reason to keep you alive now. <laughs> Hello? Hi-ho! I've given you a worthy opponent, at least. 
Nice. You should die as the little Jackie boy I once knew. Well, we need missiles, right? Because that's a freaking Metal Gear, and I don't think we're a cyborg yet. Great. I don't think we can let it rip. Uh, where are the missiles? Stinger. Damn it. Damn, okay, how do I... How in the hell do I do this? Okay. Damn! I can't do damage because... Like, it's just hard to- oh, okay. Okay, it's almost dead. Well. I thought I hit it. Oh, my Primus. Okay, uh... No, that's not what I want. Come on. Okay, so just just dodge, shoot. Dodge and shoot. Dodge and shoot. Dodge and shoot. Uh, dodge and die. There we go. Okay. Think I'm almost there. I haven't seen any of them actually get destroyed, though. Okay, uh... That hurt. Okay. Come on. Come on. Damn it! That hurt. What the heck's this? Okay. Okay, let's heal again because now we got an extra.
Okay. There we go. I'm doing good, right? Come on. Damn! That's my last Healy item. Damn! What the? Okay. Band-Aid... X. What's this? Cold medicine. Okay. Uh, heal. Okay, body armor. Come on. Come on, get the thing. How many of these things do I have to kill? Because these things are not nice. There's more of them coming, too. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't have to kill them all. I just had to kill some of them. Because <laughs> that was definitely not 20... Oh, jeez. Sorry, my controller fell. Because <laughs> the vibrations. Well, I expected a little more fight than that, Jack. Well, that's just prime. And there's Olga. Here to save today. So you decided to show yourself. <laughs> and he stops, really? Olga, don't do this. They'll know. They already know. Give you time to get away. What about you? She just wants to save her little girl. Or child. This is suicide! Your nanomachines, they're transmitting your vital signs to the Patriots. Okay. If you die, my child dies. Do you understand? The child. I see. The child. So that's why you sold your troops out to me. So many dead, and they all died trusting you! Weren't they your comrades? No, not just comrades. Family! <laughs> I know I'm going to hell, but at least my child. I applaud your attitude. If you have a death wish, oh. Should have kept that cyborg armor on. I mean, she's not actually a cyborg. It, it was a suit, right? Because she's... She probably could have taken him on if she had the suit on. Couldn't he have just crushed her skull with the tentacle? Oh, God. No. Pretty sure with a gun like that, her head shouldn't be there. Or at least there should be more splatter. <laughs> Enjoy the show, Jack. 
Let's pick up where we left off. Oh, am I gonna have to? I don't know. Something's wrong with them. The virus. Or it's becoming self aware. <laughs> no, no, it seems like they're collapsing, so. That's good at least, right? You know, I kind of feel bad for them just because they're very animal looking or acting. So it's like I can't shut it down. What happened? Maybe some kind of virus. <laughs> Patriots? I don't know. Ocelot, what have you been up to? It's too late. It's too Our late. System control is going haywire. It's on an emergency ascent course. Oh goody. Yeah, you just you just you keep you keep doing that. Stupid machines. I mean you have machines on you. Oh! Some sort of muscle suit? Enhance your performance in combat? Because you're the bad clone. <laughs> it's arm spasming as it's trying to shoot. That is some thin armor. Oh, well, I guess he was also doing something with the tentacles. You know, for machines meant to stop other nuclear weapon holding machines, Damn the not that good. They break pretty easily. You're not gonna do it. Huh? Oh, I see. Snake. I don't believe it. Bring him in. Oh, okay. Well. Yeah, I'm going to save. Why wouldn't I save? We're almost at the end. Finally. <laughs> Rectum. Nice. I want that on my save file. In fact, put it on my grave. Are you awake yet, Jack? Nah. GW. The Arsenal AI is corrupted beyond repair. Yay! I admit that I underestimated you. Thank you. Oh. Squeeze the answers out of you instead, my son. Oh, this isn't pre-rendered, okay. Ah! What? What do you hope to hear? You know he doesn't know anything. It's not him I want the answers from. Oh, it's Snake, right? You're interrogating Snake by using me. That's what you mean by our use. What do you mean? That's not your business. <laughs> oh, really? Or you're questioning the Patriots? It so happens I have some business of my own to attend to. Planning to hijack Arsenal? Huh? <laughs> you were going to screw me over, weren't you? I'd you rather she screw me. <laughs> not exactly. I was the one who used Ocelot to suggest the idea to you in the first place. Really? What? I was planning to give you Arsenal to begin with. Why the uncharacteristic generosity? <laughs> <laughs> I'm no philanthropist. Arsenal is far from impregnable. It needs other Metal Gears as guards, a uh -huh. huge payload of warheads, and full air, sea, and land support to function efficiently. 
Against a large attack force without support, Arsenal is nothing more than a gigantic coffin. Seizing <laughs> Arsenal gear was never the real objective. Oh, okay. What was your objective then? A list of names of the Patriots. But weren't you on the Council of the Patriots? They were planning to extend their control to digital information flow with GW and Arsenal. Uh -huh. That means the information they want to filter out is contained in GW. I thought Including it was deleted. That list of the highest 12 members of the Patriots Wiseman's committee. No way, he was and only the president. You they were, you would he was just a pawn. One by one. But he was hoping to become one of them? With our useless arsenal drew their fire. But then like Very good. Shadow Moses Very happened, so his plan was wrong. pooped. Were you any different? But your plans hit a snag with GW destroyed, hasn't it? No, there is another way. Really? Really. <laughs> but we have our own plans to carry out. That's true. We'll take the arsenal since you don't care for it anyway. Is it flying or floating? A nuclear oh, it's a boat. Okay. Stop them. I thought it was like a giant plane for some suddenly. The mindless masses that they control. Uh huh. First things first. Of course. Of course. That was what you wanted. I won't stop you. Good luck. Thanks, <laughs> but I have quite enough of that. <laughs> yes. What exactly do you find so funny? Oh, I thought it was Jack for a second. Trades usually are humorous. Okay. I wouldn't have minded watching some more of it, but we're running a little short on time. So am I. What are you talking about? Everything you've done here has been scripted. A little exercise set up by us. Oh. Exercise? The S3 plan was conceived as a means to reduce soldiers on par with Solid Snake. I don't get why That's my TV is squeaking. You. I'm sorry about that. But the VR training the boy was put through is not the meat of the project. You think this little terrorist incident is your own doing, Solidus? Is this it? This is the S3 training kernel. <laughs> An orchestrated recreation of Shadow Moses. What? Huh? It's not... Games and the president's deaths. A ninja. Oh. The computer virus that mimics Fox die. Did you really think they were all a coincidence? Okay. Game's own nanomachines were used to shut down his pacemaker. I arranged for the appearance of the ninja as well. Huh. As for the president, although Johnson realized what was going on he played out his allotted part as for the computer and that's why he said this was our role digital counterpart of fox die it was also designed to eliminate every scrap of information regarding the patriots from gw i Your see plan was invalidated even before execution solidus <laughs> fat man was a different story He's one of our own people. Really? The sort of examiner we hired to test the boy's progress before letting him tackle the exercise proper. Huh. We had to arrange for Stillman's presence to coax the maniac into agreeing. <laughs> if the boy had allowed the big shell to be destroyed, this exercise would have ended there. But I did. The project has no room for failures. What do you mean? Given the right situation, the right story, anyone can be shaped into snake. Really? I somehow doubt that. Even rookies can fight like men of experience. An instant creation of genius. <laughs> and this training kernel would provide more than enough data to formulate such a program. Okay. You, dead cell, Olga... You're all nothing but pawns placed to create the perfect simulation. <laughs> Solidus, 
You and the boy were selected because your relationship resembles the one between Snake and Big Boss. But he is a clone of Big Boss, isn't he? You and the rest of Dead Cell stand in for the Foxhound squad that Snake took on in Shadow Moses. Okay. You're the most impressive collection of freaks outside of Foxhound. <laughs> We've gone to a lot of trouble to set you up against the boy. That story about purified hydrogen bombs is just the tip of the iceberg. There the are no hydrogen bombs? Away when I sunk that tanker, along with your old man two years ago. Throwing your husband in the brig was a part of it, too. Oh. You were told that the eradication of Dead Cell six months ago was an act of the Patriots. We provoked and encouraged your hatred. <laughs> And you opted for vengeance, just as we planned. Nice. All orchestrated? Except for the appearance of the real Solid Snake. <laughs> I wonder now who sent for you. All our misfortune was just a part of your project? Oh. How did... I thought, what? How could... You're no Lady Luck. You have nothing that we didn't give you. Nanomachines? What? Was it a magnetic field you created with nanomachines? Or the gun? Or... I mean, they're going to explain, right? Do you know why no bullet could hit you? Nah. It wasn't magic or some new age mumbo jumbo. <laughs> it certainly wasn't your psychic talents. It was all staged by the Patriots. Staged? Huh? You were being shielded by the electromagnetic weapons technology that the Patriots developed. Okay. Your dead cell comrades loved your father and husband. We needed a pathetic wretch like you to keep them focused. You've been our puppet all along, just like Olga. I see. No. You were hamming it up as the tragic heroine, thanks to the script that the Patriots wrote for you. <laughs> Pure self-indulgence, absorbed in your own misfortune. You <laughs> can't get enough of the drama. But Vamp die didn't die there. Wanted to. Mm, thought I got her in the heart. <laughs> you missed. It missed. Or did it? Oh, I remember. Your heart's on the right. Oh, so you just popped the lung. What? A waste of metal, my dear. But your luck's run out. How did... How this did you... This is the little gizmo. There's no such thing as miracles or the supernatural. Only cutting-edge technology. But doesn't he... But, but, but there's a vampire. Bastard. I mean, I guess you could explain it with science. If, they're, if it's not related to demons or magic. Oh. God damn it. Sorry, my controller fell again. Vibrations. So, they're automated, but they can be piloted, right? So... Does that mean it, it, this now one will work I now? Data. All I have to do is retrieve Arsenal and clean up the refuse from the exercise. The refuse? Try. Cool. He's got two of them. <laughs> That's 
convenient. You didn't get hit once? How's this then? What? She's still ticking, huh? What are you doing? Fortune! You idiot! Get the hell away from there! <laughs> I told you, your luck's run out. Take your reward. It's all the payload Ray has. Oh. Die! You're gonna give her every little bit of your load, huh? It's pretty fireworks. Everybody down. <laughs> what? Did she take his thing or What the impossible? I don't know. Like I said, we got a vampire, so... <laughs> she is Lady Luck. Are you sure about that? My name is Helena Dahl Jackson. Are you related to Samuel Jackson? What? See my family again. So does she actually have psychic powers or what happened? Damn. Well, you shouldn't have wasted all your missiles in one go. Yeah, you still have the water cannon, don't you? Yeah. What liquid won't let you? No. No, not now. <laughs> liquid stopping him from using the water cannon. Kind of funny. You know, because water's a lick. Yeah, whatever. Okay, that's kind of cool. Brothers! <laughs> Liquid. Liquid. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. <laughs> it can't be. I don't get how that works. That's not how that's not how genes work. I've been inside this arm all along, waiting for the right time to awaken. <laughs> That doesn't make sense. Ocelot. No, that she sounds kind of gay. In the arm of a patriot spy. It was you two years ago? Exactly. I was controlling him. <laughs> Snake, it was I that leaked information about Arsenal to your partner and got you out here. What? Huh. You're the only one that can free me. After all... How is he gonna free you? Here. I'm off to bury the Patriots for good. You know where they are? How? Why do you think I chose Ocelot as my host? What, what do you mean chose? I, go, I have a family matter to settle with both of you. Okay. There's room for only one snake and one big boss. How does your voice change? Damn. And how is he going to be free? He, he's inside. He, he's part of an old man. It's not how. Oh, there we go. Snake, you 
Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Bum, 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 bum. Oops. I keep putting my controller down. And it keeps messing up. It keeps falling. It's kind of my fault. Well, there's New York's doom. Doom, doom, doom. I don't know, it looks more like a, a plane than a boat. I feel like it's meant to take off. Like a spaceship or something. I mean, that'd be a better place to put something like that, right? That way no one could attack it. Huh. Well, that was fast. What the heck happened? I guess New York's been destroyed. How? Ha 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 Yeah, what you laughing at, Dad? 9-11? April 30th? That's right. Okay. George Washington took office as the first president of the United States of America 200 years ago today. Man, only 200 years? We were going to declare another independence, the dawn of a new nation, here. Okay. The end of the Patriots' secret rule, liberation of this country. This was where it was supposed to begin. This is where freedom could have been born. I thought you wanted to rule the Patriots to rule the war economy. All you want is power at any cost. Jack. It's not power I want. What I wanted to take back from the Patriots are things like freedom, civil rights, opportunities. The founding principles of this country. Sure. Everything that's about to be wiped out by their digital censorship. You mean he was the good guy all along? Listen to me. We're all born with an expiration date. No one lasts forever. Especially clones with nano machines. But a grace period for turning the best of our genetic material into the next generation. Okay. The data of life is transferred from parent to child. Yeah. That's how it works. Though it does get mutated along the way. No like when you're an embryo, there's like what? Like the first time your cells split when they like when you're when you're when you're when you're, when you're like conceived like there's like 70 mutations what is our legacy if we cannot just the mutations are usually so minor that they don't really mean anything most of them anyway except for my autism when the torch is passed on from parent to child it extends beyond DNA. And my bisexuality, I guess. <laughs> well. All I want is to be remembered by other people, by history. The Patriots are trying to protect their power, their own interests, by controlling the digital flow of information. Right. I want my memory, my existence to remain. Unlike an intron of history, I will be remembered as an exon. What the heck's an Exxon? My legacy, my mark in history. But the Patriots would deny us even that. I will triumph over the Patriots. And liberate us all. And we will become the Sons of Liberty. Title drop.
Raiden, are you receiving? We're still here. How's that possible? The AI was destroyed. Only GW. Okay. Who are you? To begin with, we're not what you'd <laughs> call human. I know. Over the past 200 years, a kind of consciousness formed layer by layer in the crucible of the White House. It's not unlike the way life started in the oceans four billion years ago. Okay. The White House was our primordial soup, a base of evolution. We are formless. We are the very discipline and morality that Americans invoke so often. Really? How can anyone hope to eliminate us? As long as this nation exists, so will we. Cut the crap! If you're immortal, why would you take away individual freedoms and censor the net? <laughs> Jack, don't be silly. Don't you know that our plans have your interests, not ours, in mind? What? what? <laughs> Jack, listen carefully, like a good boy. The mapping of the human genome was completed early this century. As a result, the evolutionary log of the human race lay open to us. Uh -huh. It started with genetic engineering, and in the end, we succeeded in digitizing life itself. But there are things not covered by genetic information. What do you mean? Human memories. Memes. Ideas, culture. History. Genes don't contain any record of human history. Is it something that should not be passed on? Should that information be left at the mercy of nature? We've always kept records of our lives. Uh huh. Through words, pictures, symbols, from tablets to books. Okay. But not all the information was inherited by later generations. A small percentage of the whole was selected and processed, then passed on. Not unlike genes, really. That's what history is, Jack. Okay, but, but no one decides what genes get passed on and what don't. Accumulating every Just second, preserved chance. All its <laughs> well, not and chance, like, what genes succeed and what don't. Rumors about petty issues, misinterpretations, slander. All of this junk data preserved in an unfiltered state, growing at an alarming rate. It will only slow down social progress, reduce the rate of evolution. Right. You seem to think that our plan is one of censorship. Are you telling me it's not? You're being silly. What we propose to do is not to control content, but to create context. Create context? The digital society furthers human flaws and selectively rewards development of convenient half-truths. Just look at the strange juxtapositions of morality around you. Billions spent on new weapons in order to humanely murder other humans. Uh -huh. Rights of criminals are given more respect than the privacy of their victims. Although there are people suffering in poverty, huge donations are made to protect endangered species. Everyone grows up being told the same thing. Be nice to other people. But beat out the competition. You're special. Believe in yourself and you will succeed. But it's obvious from the start that only a few can succeed. Yeah. You exercise your right to freedom. And this is the result. But I feel like more people donate to endangered animals because and protect each other from animals are cute. The humans are ugly. Spun by different interests, continue and mean. to churn and accumulate in the sandbox of political correctness and value systems. Political correctness? Oh boy, imagine if this game was made today. They stay inside their little ponds, leaking whatever truth suits them into the growing cesspool of society at large. The different cardinal truths neither clash nor mesh. No one is invalidated, but nobody is right. Not even natural selection can take place here. The world is being engulfed in truth. And this is the way the world ends. Not with a bang, but a whimper. We're trying to stop that from happening. It's our responsibility as rulers. Just <laughs> rulers? As genetics, unnecessary information and memory must be filtered out to stimulate the evolution of the species. And you think you're qualified to decide what's necessary and not? <laughs> Absolutely. Who else could wade through the sea of garbage you people produce, retrieve valuable truths, and even interpret their meaning for later generations? That's what it means to create context. I'll decide for myself what to believe and what to pass on. But is that even your own idea? Or something Snake told you? <sighs> That's the proof of your incompetence right there. You lack the qualifications to exercise free will. <laughs> That's not true. I have the right. 
Does something like a self exist inside of you? That which you call self serves as nothing more than a mask to cover your own being. In this era of ready-made truths, self is just something used to preserve those positive emotions that you occasionally feel. Another possibility is that self is a concept you conveniently borrowed under the logic that would endow you with some sense of strength. That's crap! Is it? Would you prefer that someone else tell you? <laughs> then, explain it to him. Jack, you're simply the best, and you got there all by yourself. Oh, what happened? Do you feel lost? Why not try a bit of soul searching? Don't think you'll find anything, though. Yeah, you souls don't exist. That all <laughs> this self is something that you yourself fashion. Every time something goes wrong. Then again, they might in the Metal Gear universe because apparently she was it's a psychic and fault. yeah, it's vampires. Not your fault. In denial, you simply resort to looking for another more convenient truth. In order to make yourself feel better. Leaving yeah. behind in an instant the so-called truth you once embraced. Should someone like that be able to decide what is truth? Should someone like you even have the right to decide? You've done nothing but abuse your freedom. You don't deserve to be free. We're not <laughs> the ones smothering the world. You are. The individual is supposed to be weak, but far from powerless. A single person has the potential to ruin the world. And the age of digitized communication has given even more power to the individual. Too much power. I mean, we did meme President Trump into, you know, a legacy the God White House and look what he's doing what now. And what We're on the verge of freaking war with Russia. Or America is. I'm Canadian, so. <laughs> now we think for you. But, uh, your guardians, pretty sure you. nukes would affect me you too. To control human thought? Human behavior? Of course, <laughs> anything can be quantified nowadays. Well, you would need to insert nano machines to everyone. You fell in love with me just as you were meant to, after all. Isn't that right, Jack? Ocelot was not told the whole truth, to say the least. We rule an entire nation. Of what interest would a single soldier, no matter how able, be to us? The S3 plan does not stand for solid snake simulation. Okay. What it does stand for is selection for societal sanity. What? The S3 is a system for controlling human will and consciousness. Okay. S3 is not you, a soldier trained in the image of solid snake. Really? Because I was liking that explanation. It Fission mailed. <laughs> A protocol that created a circumstance that made you what you are. So you see, we're the S3, not you. Okay. <laughs> what you experienced was the final test of its effectiveness. That's crazy. You heard what President Johnson said. The Arsenal's GW system is the key to their supremacy. The objective of this exercise was to establish such a method. So you're gonna put everyone through war? I used Shadow Moses as a paradigm for the exercise. I wonder if you would have preferred a fantasy setting. <laughs> <laughs> we chose that backdrop because of its extreme circumstances. It was an optimal test for S3's crisis management capacity. If the model could trigger, control, and solve this, it would be ready for any contingency. And now, we have our proof. Okay. I'm not really following along. <laughs> Raiden, there are also reasons behind your selection. Solidus raised plenty of other child soldiers. Do you know why we chose you over them? Nah. It was because you were the only one who refused to acknowledge the past. All the others <laughs> remember what they were and pay for it daily. But you turn your back on everything you don't like. You do whatever you like, see only the things you like, and for yourself alone. Yes, Rose can attest to that. You refused to see me for what I was. I lied to you, but I wanted to be caught. You pretended to be understanding, to be a gentleman. You never made a conscious attempt to reach out to me. 
The only <laughs> time you did was when I gave you no choice but to do so. I was just trying not to. What? Trying not to hurt me? Dear, the one you were trying not to hurt was yourself. Avoiding the truth under the guise of kindness is all that you did. It occurred to you to do nothing but look out for yourself. Even if you claim that it was for my sake, that feeling was nowhere to be seen. In okay. the end, everything was for your sake. I was never part of the picture. <laughs> exactly right. So you see, you're a perfect representative of the masses we need to protect. This is why we chose you. You accepted the fiction we provided, obeyed our orders, okay. and did everything you were told to. The exercise is a resounding success. Didn't hey, we can go home GW now. Was still incomplete, but not anymore, thanks to you. Your persona, experiences, triumphs, and defeats are nothing but byproducts. The real objective was ensuring that we could generate and manipulate them. It's taken a lot of time and money, but it was well worth it considering the results. I think that's enough talk. It's time for the final exercise. Raiden, take Solidus down. Think again. I'm through doing what I'm told. Oh, really? Aren't you forgetting something? What? If you die, my child dies. The termination of vital signals from your nanomachines means the death of Olga's child. Oh, no. Not to mention the death of Rose. She's wired the same way. Rose, does she actually exist? Of course I do, Jack. <laughs> you have to believe me. Damn! It will be a fight to the death. Solidus at least wants you dead. We will collect the necessary data <laughs> from this last fight. Then we'll consider the exercise closed. So, Jack the Ripper, will it be Solidus, the Patriot's creation, or you, Solidus's creation? Our beloved monsters, <laughs> enjoy yourselves. Okay. Jack. Yes? My son. You're not my dad. <laughs> my clone brothers and I are called monsters. Replicates of evil genes. You are one of a kind, but still a monster, shaped by a dark and secret history. Yeah. We need to decide which monstrosity will have the privilege of survival. Well. By the way, Jack, Natural selection seems to prefer sexual I was reproduction. The one who your parents. Nani? <laughs> Well, do I get the oh no. I claimed you for my own and raised you as a soldier in the army of the devil. I am your foster father and your worst enemy. Why? Because I needed to know whether you we were really someone <laughs> else's creation. We're repeating history, Jack. Liquid and solid hunted down Big Boss, trying to sever the tie that bound them to him. Uh huh. Unless you kill me and face your past, Jack, you will never escape. You'll stay in the endless loop, your own double helix. Huh. It's time we so were we... both free. Well, at least he's gonna give us a fair fight. Really? The clues to the Patriots inside GW have been erased, but there are other traces. Where? Inside you. What? The information is being carried by the nanomachines in your cerebral cortex and oh. about the neural network they formed. Cool, I guess. Well then, let's dance. <laughs> Brace yourself. Uh huh. Ah, okay, that that burns. 
Oof. Oof. Okay, uh... Do I have healing? Yes, I have one, so I should save it. Okay. Yay! Too bad there's no lock on. Okay. Come on. This is very easy. Oh. He says as he falls to his death. I forgot that X was not up. Because that's how it is in normal games. Oh, there's a thing. Hold up. The fact that I can barely see does not help. <laughs> what the? It's almost like I'm old or something. This is good though. Nothing, Dad. Come on. What does that second gauge mean, anyway? I guess the fight between Liquid and Snake wasn't that epic anyway, or either. What? Okay. Um... But, didn't that help you? Oh, okay, he can do that without it. Nice. Yes, what is it? Right, you have to beat Solidus. This is your last duty. Is it? You're not just pawns in some simulation game, you know. Yes, you are. You're nothing but mere weapons. No different from Oh, she has no pupils now. Tanks. What the the old model destroyed four years ago was Rex. The new amphibious model is Ray. Both of these are the same as the code names used by the U.S. Armed Forces to refer to Japanese warplanes during oh, World I War II. I got a II. text? Are you Your kidding me? Code name Raiden 2 comes from the Japanese Navy's name for one of its interceptors. Sorry about that. I'm not a weapon. Oh, really? Do you know the code name the U.S. Armed Forces used for the Japanese fighter Raiden? It was Jack. Both of you are just weapons to be used and thrown away. Just weapons to be used on the battlefield. Just pawns in a game, exactly as you said. And a weapon has no right to think for itself. Now, it's time to fulfill your purpose. Defeat Solidus. Okay. What's wrong? How do I get up faster? Jeez.
I'm starting to think Hideo Kojima wanted to do a hack and slash. Like, doesn't Raiden appear in the next game too, but he only, like, he don't get, you don't get to play as him, he just does cutscenes? He, or he's just in the cutscenes? Come on, it's almost over. What's wrong with you? I don't know. You made me. <laughs> uh huh. Oh. Oh! It's very anime. I mean, I should have expected as much with the katanas and all that. Uh huh. What you gonna do? What, what did he say? Huh. Oh, he's still alive. You gonna finish him off? No? Just gonna let him bleed out? I mean, don't you think that's a little more cruel? Than finishing him off? You know? But alright. Why is the sky like this? Well, actually, I think there was like an entire segment they cut out about Saldus destroying the city or the thing destroying the city, but because of 9 11, you know. Where is everyone? Did they flee as soon as like they saw a big thing heading towards the city? I feel like the streets would be packed. Hello? Really? You guys are just gonna... Just go back to everything? Go doing everything? The means you have and the role you were assigned are burdens you had to carry. It doesn't matter if they were real or not. That's never the point. No one's questioning what... <laughs> okay. There's no such thing in the world as absolute reality. Most of what they call real is actually fiction. Huh? Well, I mean, it is made what in your brain. What you think you see is only as real as your brain tells you it is. Right. But then, what am I supposed to believe in? What am I going to leave behind when I'm through? We can tell other people about having faith. What we had faith in. What we found important enough to fight for. It's not whether you were right or wrong, but how much faith you were willing to have. That decides the future. The Patriots are a kind of ongoing fiction too, come to think of it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Listen, don't obsess over words so much. Find the meaning behind the words, then decide. You can find your own name. But I know if I jump in front of a moving car, I'm gonna get hurt <laughs> or die. I don't know if I can. I know you didn't have much in terms of choices this time, but everything you felt, thought about during this mission is yours, and what you decide to do with them is your choice. 
Thanks, Snake. You mean start over? Yeah, a clean slate, a new name, new memories. Hmm. Choose your own legacy. It's for you to decide. Until that choice is taken away from him, because I'm betting you didn't want to become an android for the Patriots or cyborg. But I say android. By the way, what is that? What is what? Dog tags. Oh. It's me. Anyone you know? No. No. Never heard the name before. Yeah, I doubt you would, because it's not an actual my name. name. And my own life. I'll find something worth passing on. Well, thanks. That's cool. That's cute. They taught me some good things, too. I know. We've inherited freedom from all those who fought for it. We all have the freedom to spread the word. Even me. Snake, what about Olga's child? Don't worry. I'll find him. Count on it. How do you know it's a him? As long as you keep yourself alive, he's safe. Oh. That's good. Do you know where Liquid went? I put a transmitter on his ray. Did he head for the Patriots? Yeah. But I have a feeling they gave Ocelot a bogus location to begin with. Probably. Hmm. Cheer up. We have a better lead. This contains the list of all the Patriots. Oh. But Ocelot took it. The one we gave you wasn't the real thing. What? What? This virus is coded to destroy only a specific part of GW, namely the information about the Patriots' identity. Okay. Which means that there's a parameter coded in here that defines what that information is. Yeah. I get it. Analyze the code and you can probably find out where they operate. Count me in. No, you have things to do first. Like what? And people you need to talk to. Is he going to be standing right there? Because that'd be weird. Okay. Alright, let's forget everything happened. I don't think people would go back to work that quickly. Sup? There's the parrot? What's wrong? Or is that a dove? It sounded like a dove, but it, it looked Can green. I... Everything looks green. Can I ask you something? Who am I, really? I wouldn't know. But we're going to find out together, aren't we? Oh. Sure. Yeah. So to just let her go? I mean, he'll find out when the kid's born. I mean, assuming your genes will be dominant, I mean, dark hair is usually more dominant than light hair. Do you remember this place? Nope. Of course. This is where we first met. How convenient. Now. Today is the day I met you. <laughs> That's it. Huh. Two hours. <laughs> I think I found something to pass along to the future. What? 
He said all living things want their genes to live on. Are you talking about the baby? Yeah. The genes aren't the only thing you pass on. There are too many things that aren't written into our DNA. Well, yeah, the things you experience. That to our children. What kind of things? About the environment, our ideas, our culture, poetry, compassion, sorrow, joy. Actually, I'm pretty sure emotional Without response is kind of written into your DNA. <laughs> is that a proposal? This is for your ears only. <laughs> Okie dokie. Why does this piano sound familiar? Okay, I'm going to have to, uh, uh, what, what do I have to say? What do I have to say? Um, what am I, made of? I mean, it was good. I mean, confusing and needed a lot of explanations and cutscenes, but, uh, it was good. Uh, I think I liked the first one better. First Metal Gear. And I definitely love Metal Gear Rising more. <laughs> but, you know, that's just because it's way more over the top and all that. Or maybe the cutscenes are less long. Um, well, and the gameplay is just... It's not a... The controls are not similar to any other game you play nowadays. They're just... I don't like tank controls. I hope they get rid of them in 4. Hopefully that's the case. Uh, so yeah. I'm gonna leave this here. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye End credit scene. Hello? Life isn't just about passing on your genes. Okay. You leave behind much more than just DNA. Through speech, music, literature, and movies, what we've seen, heard, felt, anger, joy, and sorrow. Uh huh. These are the things I will pass on. That's what I live for. We need to pass the torch and let our children read our messy and sad history by its light. Uh-huh. We have all the magic of the digital age to do that with. The human race will probably come to an end sometime. And yeah. new species may rule over this planet. I Earth doubt not that. Forever, but we still have the responsibility to leave what traces of life we can. But we can't because, you know, the sun's gonna... Well, I guess we can because we have the Voyager probe in space and that's still going, right? So, even when the sun goes supernova, at least that'll still exist. If it doesn't hit anything. It'll probably hit something eventually. Snake! You there? It's me. I've finished going over that disc. Uh-huh. Did you find the Patriot's list? Of course. It contains the personal data of 12 people. Nice. There was a name on it. Snake, it was one of our biggest contributors. Really? What's going on around here? I don't know. Anyway, where are they? Well, we were right about them being on Manhattan, but... But what? They're already dead. All 12 of them. Nani? Did it happen? Well... About a hundred years ago. What the hell? So is it is it actually the AI that Ryan was talking to?